Hey everybody, I'm C. Andrew Nelson, founder of Aquatacy. Have you ever added wood pieces to an aquarium layout only to find that days later that there's something growing on that wood and it's not plants and it's not moss and it's not algae? It looks like some kind of white fungus. Well, don't worry, it's not what you think it is. Oh, it's definitely a fungus, all right, but it's not harmful like you thought it was. Whether it's a newly cycled or well-established tank, your aquarium and everything that goes into it has the potential to carry bacteria. Beneficial bacteria abounds in the aquarium. Its job is to break down organic waste so that it doesn't build up and become a health issue for your fish. Each time you add something new to your tank, rocks, plants, wood, etc., that beneficial bacteria will check it out to see if it's a good spot to settle down and call home. Wood is particularly attractive to them because it can release edible substances such as carbohydrates. That's like a 24-hour buffet for your bacteria colony. The visible effect of this process happening is a thick white cottony film that can spread out all over your wood pieces. Even if you have previously soaked or boiled your wood before it was placed in your layout, you might still experience it. It looks unsightly, but it's not dangerous at all. So okay, Andrew, how do I get rid of it? Well, there are basically three things you can do about it. The first being to physically remove it by hand. Reach into your tank and scrape the white fuzziness off the wood or pull the wood out of your aquarium and give it a thorough scrub down. If you don't want to disturb your hardscape, you can send in a cleanup crew. Bristlenose plecos and autosynclus catfish will gladly gobble up that yummy fungus. Snails will also do the job for you, assuming you want snails in your tank. Or you can squirt the fungus with hydrogen peroxide to dissipate it, or dose it with a product like Seachem's XL. Any of these methods will eventually do the trick. There is also a fourth method. Do nothing. That's right, don't do anything at all. This is a perfectly natural process. When the wood stops releasing carbs and the beneficial bacteria have gorged themselves, that white fungus will disappear. I know it looks bad in this tank right now, but I purposely let it get this bad so I could show you. Trust me, this will all go away on its own. Whichever course of action or inaction you choose, don't panic. This is simply nature being natural but hopefully now you have an idea of what's going on. It's the unknown that usually strikes fear in us. No need to fear this fungus. Thank you so much for watching, and until next time, blessings to you.